People come out of there all high and then they get into their cars. That was a weird interaction. What the heck are you doing? Ah, it is 34 degrees and sunny. And then had an effort to see if anybody else is intrepid like me. On the first Sunday of the month, every month, there is a gathering of motorcyclists and other like-minded two- and three-wheeler people. It is a beautiful morning. It is crisp. Like I said, 34 degrees, so it is crisp. One of the downsides of riding on a cold morning, you get a little bit of mist forming on my helmet visor. And I've heard of a lot of products that help with that, and some do, some don't. One of the nice things, though, is really get use out of my heated grips this morning. <laughs> I've got heavier winter gloves on. They're actually heated gloves, but they are, have a short, at least in the right one. And if I use them, I get nice little shots to my fingers, which is always fun. So it is just above freezing, but it is cold. It's okay, though. I, I like riding in the cold. It's racing. It feels good. One major difference between this and the PCX is the lower body coverage, the lower body protection. There isn't as much of it, so I do feel the wind a little bit more on my ankles. I'm wearing boots, so that does help, but even so. Oh, what a lovely ride this is been. One thing I will say, since the end of the lockdowns here in the U.S. last year, the one day of the week where there does seem to be a whole lot less traffic on the roads is Sundays. Every other day of the week seems actually worse. There are times, like 6 o'clock in the morning is very light, but Sunday mornings do not seem to be nearly as busy as they used to be. I think a lot fewer people are going to church. Just anecdotal observations. Building like that. I don't know why. I like old barns and stuff. Probably just the nostalgia and thinking of history and so on. With older buildings, I wonder the people who work there and the history that exists. People who put their lives into working at a little factory or a garage or a shop of some sort. And always makes me wonder. My brain is going elsewhere now and thinking about the mills back in Warrenoko and what about all the lives of the people who made paper for Strathmore? And those mills are now deserted. I've never had a bike with heated grips before. This is nice. <laughs> Pull my fingers out of the wind and wrap them around the heated grips. I might invest in a pair of hippo hands, though. Oh, I'm wearing my watch. My watch has been dead for a day. <laughs> I forgot to charge it overnight, I forgot to take it off and put it on the charger. Completely useless at the moment, but hey, I'll put it on the charger when I get home. <laughs> so I'm going to go down Queen Street, and I fish down in there with my wife. It's a good place to fish. It gives us something to do on a Sunday afternoon after church. And it's a beautiful place to fish. It's just a beautiful place to be. Now the one difference between today and most of the rest of the year, is since this is not an official ride-in, you know, there may still be people here. And we'll see, I don't know. Yeah, there's a few folks here. A few intrepid sort, braving the elements. There's a small group. Ah, one of the new Harley things. Cool. I didn't know if anyone had actually bought one of these yet. Nice scooter. It's actually kind of cool. It looks pretty decent in the middle. 
Mind if I get a picture of your bike? No problem. And of course you showed up on your hog. <laughs> I pulled in and I said, well, where are we going today? There you go. <laughs> You'll follow for at least a mile or two before the battery runs out. Yeah. <laughs> what year is your Nighthawk? I had an 83 Sabre. Really? And uh, that was a lovely bike. Do it again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow, man. Don't die on our account, but that would make great views on video. <laughs> that squirrel almost ate it. Uh, well, that was an interesting morning. Just took pictures today. I didn't really do much video. Other than that, really, that was really cool. <laughs> that was awesome. I had a little electric scooter. But you're just wheeling it along. That was awesome. There weren't as many bike stairs on a normal day, but it's not, I'd say about 15 people showed up total, which is nice. That's generally how these ride-ins go in November, December, January, and February. Usually only a few guys show up, but you get to have nice conversations. It's not so, there's not so many people that you kind of get lost in the crowd. The funny thing is, there was only the one scooter there, and it was a little electric. But everybody kept talking about scooters. I didn't have mine there. <sighs> Almost makes me want to go home and grab that, but I need to go to church. Nice thing about this getup is I get seen, and on a cold day, without a whole lot of motorcyclists out, it's good to be visible. Now, this is my first longer ride on this since I got it back so much better. The brakes don't feel at all weird, and they did feel weird before. I will say the nice thing about today's ride-in is that there were fewer Harley guys there. Now there was that one really interesting Harley, which is a newer one. Now it's only interesting because it's different from Harley. That's the, the Pan American that was there. <laughs> Hello, pals. That corner always seems to have something on it from somebody coming in and out of the field there. And there's horse poop on the road. <laughs> the roads would be much more enjoyable if you didn't have to worry about the leadings of the Amish. <laughs> and Mennonites with their horses and buggies. Nothing against them, it's just, it makes the roads a little bit more uh, treacherous. Treacherous? Treacherous. <laughs> this is a beautiful area though. I love the farms. I love the old houses. Ooh, lots of birds. Hello, birds. Uh, nice greenery. Very nice. Soybean uh, field. Hello, soybean field. Well, folks, it's been a beautiful day. I'll probably add a couple of other things at the beginning of the video as far as a couple of cool skulls and weird stuff. But I'm going to make this mostly about the ride in today. Hope you enjoyed it.